Along with her dope music and fashion, another thing Aaliyah was known for was her fit body. How exactly did she maintain it? Well, let's find out. Foremost, Aaliyah stated she had always been active since childhood, whether it was skating, swimming, or dancing. In the late 90s, Aaliyah would do extensive touring, so in order to maintain her energy and stamina on stage, she would hire her personal trainer, Dion, in Los Angeles, and they would work out five days a week. During these workouts, they would do what Aaliyah called total body workouts involving weights. She also did aerobics, drank a lot of water, and took vitamins like aloe vera gel caps for her throat and skin. Whenever Aaliyah was too busy, she would hit the gym when given a chance and take step classes, which she considered to be a favorite. Aaliyah admitted to having a weakness for foods like cheese, chocolate, waffles, pancakes, and French toast. Oh uh, yeah, well, you like showing off your bare midriff. Why is that? Do you have to diet and all that stuff? Yeah, I, I have to watch what I eat because if I don't watch... I heard you like waffles. I love waffles. I like syrup. I like anything sweet. And if I don't watch it, it'll start showing up up and around here. Do you like do you like waffles and syrup together or do you just like them separately? You like syrup and... Together. Look at this. Butter. But Why after it? beginning her diet, she stated, once living without something for a while, you crave it less and less. She then only started eating healthy low fats with lots of grains, fruits, and vegetables, excluding red meat, dairy, and pork. Alia loved pizza as well, but because she didn't eat cheese anymore, she found an alternative in the restaurant California Pizza Kitchen, which made her favorite, grilled eggplant cheeseless pizza. She then developed a new liking for turkey bacon and sausage. As a plan to satisfy her cravings, Aaliyah's trainer would allow her one cheat day out the week, what she called his magic plan. She spent these cheat days dining on a plate of waffles at Roscoe's House of Chicken and Waffles in Los Angeles. She would also hit up Baskin Robbins, where she had a knack for their Jamocha ice cream. This ice cream included vanilla ice cream with vanilla syrup, nuts, whipped cream, and cherries. Being asked about her body image, Aaliyah admitted to always being small, even drawing back on memories of getting teased at 10 years old for being so skinny and small chested with thin calves and ankles. She later declared that even though she still considered herself small, she learned to accept and love her body as we all should. Although Aaliyah had a naturally fit and petite figure, she still had her diet regimen to help maintain it. Most importantly, she never let her body image get to her head and she always promoted body positivity. Please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Thank you for watching and listening. I'll see y'all in the next video.